Morning, it's Sharon again from Thursday Grows, the team down at the community garden and I just wanted to share with you what I've been up to this morning. Um, it's just wanting to reflect a little bit on food waste and how much food we've, that we are putting collectively, I am putting sometimes into landfill and how I can avoid that and do better composting and systems at home. Um, just finished my banana so that's what got me thinking. Um, so I weighed some food waste. This is a small takeaway box that you get. I put some food waste in that and I weighed that up. That's about 0.5 of a kilogram. I thought, well, I'll make that maybe in a meal if I'm cooking at home for me and my family. It's raining outside. I upgraded ever so slightly and um, got one of these sweetie boxes. No, I didn't eat all the sweets. And I weighed that one. I filled that with food waste and I weighed that. And that comes in at about one kilogram when I put that full of food. So I'd say for myself, that's probably like, if that box was sat empty on the side, I could probably fill that in a couple of days. No bother at all, just with the fruit peelings and stuff that we eat at home. So I upgrade enough, well, what do I eat in a week? And I don't eat healthy every night and I don't cook every night, but I do try. And we do have a lot of food and fruit and veg in the house. And so I would say for myself and my family, something like that. It's actually quite a fair bit of weight to that. Um, that's full of food waste and that comes in at about two kilograms of waste so when I start to think about it like that I'm actually producing quite a lot of food waste out of my kitchen and it's just a small kitchen there's just three of us um, at two kilograms if that was a week's worth over a year that would be 104 kilograms that's 104 kilograms that's like myself holding my child that's an awful lot of things that I could avoid putting to landfill if I just had a little bit more process and thought um, of done more videos before and I'll do them again about worm composting and also it's like super simple solutions that you can do at home but um, I'm about to go and feed all this food to our worm bin, our worm bin that we've made before at the gardens and we do more composting sessions are really super easy to make, super cheap, super simple to upkeep and maintain and your outputs that you get is beautiful additives to put to the soil that the worms have made for you and also happy worms but who doesn't want happy worms in the garden. Um, whereas if I put 104 kilograms of me and my daughter into landfill this year, it'd be too much. It's not going to save the planet. We're in a climate emergency.